pay attention to the register. We are speeding it up. 120, 150, 20, 120, 150, 150. Ladies and gentlemen, please use the power of the label master at the maximum speed of 200 meters per minute. Thank you. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Selamat siang, Papa Papa Ibu Ibu. Welcome to the second session of our Gaudu's Open House. I'm Jackson Tan, the uh, regional head of sales for Gaudu's Asia Pacific. And together with me is Murti, our regional application specialist. So together we will be presenting to you our current best selling model from Gaudu's, the Labor Master 440. So since the launch of this Labor Master series, we already have more than 300 presses installed worldwide. And out of this, we have more than 40 machines all across Asia, from Australia, to Japan, to China, Thailand, India, and of course, including in Indonesia. So why is this Labor Master so popular? Why is it so well accepted? by with repeat orders from our customer. So our customer tell us uh, this label master is very stable, it's very reliable, so that it enables it enable me to churn out job uh, with little wastage, so it saves time and save money for me. We have also customer who tell us that they really like the new concept of this barrel guide printing cylinder of Labor Master, which gives them the confidence of the reliability and a high print quality from start to end with stable registration. We also have customers who tell us Gavos Labor Master is very friendly, very easy to use. Yeah? Because it's very flexible, uh, very easy to change over for different applications from um, D-Lamp, re -lamp, backside printing, full foil, UV, water base. So this allows them to handle job for various applications for a very diverse demand from, our, from their customer. So therefore, let us demonstrate to you the stability, the reliability, and the productivity and also the user friendliness of our Dalus Labor Master. Right, without further ado, Mundi, let's start the press, let's get it going and show us what the Labor Master can do for us. And now we'll be doing this job which is also in the sample pack. Uh, it's a four color plus orange, four point, spot money. Rotary die guard metric rewinder. Right, so this is the configuration we do. We also have it in the center pack. And I would like you to pay attention at the uh, web video where the press is uh, speeding up. Okay? Look at the stability of this register of this five color CMYK plus the orange. It's 50 meters now. Now we are wrapping up the speed at 50 meters per minute. We are speeding it up. 70. 70. Take a look. 100. So we have already reached up to the production speed of 100. For the beginning until now, the state, the register state. Moti has not done any adjustment on the press, on the pressure or the register control and is staying very well. So, why is it possible is because Gallows, we, we are coming in this press with a very smart and automated auto register system, which is called the web to frame auto register system, where we have sensor at every printing unit. 
head again. Been holding it well, even at a speed of 100 meters per minute. Okay, this is what I tell you earlier. Our customer tell us the stability and the reliability of the crane at perfect register with cold point and rotary die cut. Hey, what thing? Can we go faster? Can we print at a maximum speed of 200 meters per minute? Okay, would you say yes? He can. He can print at 200 meters per minute, but he said this, this is not practical, right? That to run this job with cold foil and die cut, uh, which will affect the print quality at this maximum speed. This is very dear. But he will attempt to run the job without cold foil and die cut. So simulating a job that will change over to a mono material such as sleep, mono film or mono paper. So it rolls to roll. Okay, so let's uh, do a little a job change. Doing same job but slightly different. Yes. So you can see now we are simulating to do a, a pressure sensitive labor to a monofilm material. So we are now adjusting and removing the uh, metric so that we are running without the die cut. Alright, so to disengage the pressure for the uh, rotary die cut. So the impression is off. And now we also attempt to cut off the foil, simulating that this is the job without the core foil. So just how you see that this uh, Another feature about this press is also the uh, flexible process exchangeability. Right, you may notice there's also an empty position here, in the nine position here. Right, so that so Gardos press is modular. Modular. Meaning you can add additional unit later on. For example, you can add another flexo head or another screen unit. But the best part is the unit that you have on the press, for example a screen unit, can be freely interchangeable. Meaning you can move the screen unit from here to the front. Right? Simulating that you have a job that requires opaque white underlay or opaque white as an over screen. So you need to move this process and goggles allow you to do this freely, fully exchangeable between unit to unit. So now we uh, off with the bow point. And we would like to also simulate like a plate change. Right? Multi will be attempt to take out the print cylinder and uh, imagine that we're doing a, a plate change and putting back. And like to pay, when the press is running out, I would like to pay attention to you, how well and how fast you can pass, come back to the register again. So you can see, uh, label mark is very user friendly. All right, a cylinder can just pop it up like this. And then, imagine we're now doing a different job with a different image, for example. Simply just pop it in. Lock. And the cylinder, when it runs, you will be automatically engage, and you will find its zero position and ready to run the track again. So, we're changing a PSA job to a mono material job. 
changing with the brick color, engage, disengage and engage. So I would like to pay attention on the fifth unit. When the register, that's how we have disengaged. So then the fifth color will be gone. Imagine now we are changing. Right, four color now. And now we that's how we have put it back. Without doing any adjustment, the fifth unit, fifth unit color is back again. Right? And Moti will now attempt to speed up the press. 80 meters per minute. 80 meters per minute. Okay, pay attention to the register. We are speeding it up. 120, 150, 20, 120, 150. 150 170 170 200 Ladies and gentlemen, please feel the power of the label master at the maximum speed of 200 meters per minute. Thank you. And notice, the register of all your units has never moved. Despite we have through a changeover and despite that we are ramping up the speed from 0 to 200 and you can feel the quietness, the steadiness of the trend. So another point about stability of the trend here is also because it's a very short wet half in this labor master design. Each printing unit the web path is only 1.4 meters. The total length of this web or this eight color plus die cut, only the web path is only 15 meters, one five. Meaning every time you change over, there's a weight. With this short web path, the weightage is very minimum. Okay. Just how I mentioned about the flexibility of our customer need to handle job or various application. So, Muti, can you tell us more about our equipment and what are the additional devices uh, we have in the press? Uh, yeah. Over here is the secondary platform. We have some web path rollers, web turn bar, and also a delay relent unit. So, delay relent unit here is to Print on the blue side where you can actually print it on the adhesive side and then you print it on the top of the uh, face top of the material again. So that's the function of the relay relay and that's the red turn bar. The red turn bar uh, has a micro porous uh, structure on the roller. That's to actually reduce the stretches if you go through the uh, vector bar. We have UV system. It's, it's all uh, uh, UV curing uh, ink. So we have two systems here. One is the conventional UV and the other one here is the LED. So now at the moment we have two combinations. Which the job is actually with the LED UV and also a combination of the standard factory lights. On the last unit, we have also added a weapon, uh, sorry, a hot air dryer. That's for water-based ink. So in addition to UV curing, you also have a hot air option to run with water-based ink. So LED UV system is getting very common, especially like country like Japan and China. But it's also gaining popularity in other parts of Asia, including Indonesia. So why? I mean, so LED UV system may cost more in your invest, capital investment. It's more expensive. But 
it will save you money in the long run. Why? Because the LED UV system have a significant saving in your electricity bill. LED UV system compared to the conventional UV system shows that you can have an 80% reduction in energy consumption. 80 percent consumption reduction in energy consumption. The lamp is different. LED lamp also lasts much longer than the standard mercury lamp. So the standard mercury lamp usually lasts about 1,000 hours. LED lamp can last 10,000 hours. So this is 10 times longer in terms of lifespan of LED lamp versus the standard mercury lamp. So for those who are conscious about sustainability, these reductions in energy consumption of the LED UV system can also decrease your business carbon footprint. Right? Having a good return investment but long term cost savings. So another feature of our label master is also our twin cylinder concept. Right, Master will help me to show you. So the design of our label master twin cylinder is unique. It's a unique design only available in Gallo system, which they have barrel ring on both sides. It's not a slip system that what you usually accustomed to. Barrel ring. So the benefit of this solid cylinder with barrel ring, which is supported on both sides, against the impression drum. So with this design, it reduces the printing strip and vibration, especially at high speed, which we just now see 200 meters per minute. It reduces the vibration of the strip there. It has an excellent print quality due to the stability of this new barrel holding each other on both sides. But lastly, the printing pressure adjustment has no effect on the analog roller. So which minimizes your setup time, quick make ready, reduce your wastage, so overall, save time and save money for you. Okay, so that's the end of our presentation. I would like to ask uh, Moti to get the press going again in either speed and I would like you to come forward, take a closer look at the Labour Master. Come. And then of course, don't get too close to touch the machine. Safety comes first. Before we bring you to the next presentation area. But meanwhile, please come over. We get the press running. You can feel the action or the few benefits that I highlight.